Where are your clothes? Are you eating them? No, silly. Well, it looks like you have to put this on. Hurry and come on. Looks like it's gonna be another one of those days where you have to come with me to my meeting because your nanny is still out sick. Come on, hurry. Stay right here and don't move, okay? Our security guard, Rhonda, she's gonna take care of you, all right? Got your tablet. I'll be right next door. If you need anything, you just holler and I'll be right out, okay? Yes. Thank you again, Rhonda. Anytime, girl. All right, you know you're my girl. <laughs> hey, sweetie. What you watching? Hi, Faye. Hi, Faye. Hi, I have more stuff for you. Oh, thank you. Faye! Faye! Faith, where are you? Oh, oh I my gotta God. go. There she is. <gasps> Faith, what were you? I fell asleep. What were you thinking? I was just helping. Oh, I'm sorry. I almost didn't see you two there. My name is Jess. This is my daughter, Faith, and my friend, Rhonda. What are your names? My name is Sherry, and this is my daughter, Dawn. Well, it's freezing out here. Come on, let's get inside. I can take you all home. Outside is our home. We're homeless. Homeless? A mother and a daughter on the street? For how long and since when? We've been out here a couple days. You know, there was a storm, and we don't have any family out here. It's just us. We have seen you before, but you're usually in a hurry. I just don't think you've noticed. I'm so sorry. If I would have saw you, I definitely would have said something. Okay. Little Faith here. She's been bringing us food and snacks every day. She's been visiting us every day at the same time. It's really been getting us through. So this is where all the clothes have been coming up missing at the house. She's been giving them to you two. Faith, you are a daily reminder of how good God's grace is. I'm so thankful for you. Well, come on, I actually have an extra home and you two can stay at it for as long as you need. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. I, I knew if I had a little bit of faith that God would help us. Moral of the story is, children can teach us so much about life if we stop and we pay attention. Never be in so much of a hurry that you don't notice those in need around you. If you find yourself in a situation you can't help yourself out of, just have a little faith in God and God will help you.